For most of us, school is coming soon, which means school supplies. If you're like me, you're tired of dull and boring school supplies like these pens. While buying kawaii pens from a stationery store or online can be fun and cool, it can get a little pricey. I'm going to show you how to turn these dull pens into super, super cute and kawaii pens for less than a dollar each. So let's get started! All you're going to need is a transparent pen like this, some pliers, scissors, some memo paper, some cute tape like this or some duct tape, some background paper or scrapbook paper, and some computer paper. The first method I'm going to show you is by using this memo pad. So just go through your memo pad and choose your favorite design. This is mine. And I'm going to rip out one or two sheets of it. Then I'm going to take my pen, take the cap off, and using my pliers, I'm going to take the ink part out and also the cap, just like this. Make sure you don't lose these though because you're going to be needing them later. Now I'm going to take my memo sheet and cut it in half. And then slowly I'm going to roll the paper as thin as I can go. Take the tight coil you just made of paper and put it right into the pen like this. You might need to use some scissors to help push it in. You don't want to fill it all the way with paper because you need space for the little cap. And then just put everything back on, including the ink and the cap, and you're done. If you don't have memo paper, another awesome option is to go on Google Images and search some kawaii pictures like these. And I'll put a link down below of where I found this because there are a lot of other pictures as you can see. And all you're going to do is copy that image that you like and paste it and print it out. Then I'm going to cut it out into a smaller piece just like we were doing before with the memo paper. Now just measure it using your pen. Make sure you take everything out like we did last time. And then just trim it down to size, and we're going to roll it up again like last time. Another option is using scrapbook or background paper that you can find at any craft store. I'm just going to measure it and cut it down to size and then trim it. And you're just going to follow the same steps we've been doing. Now this last method is for pens that are white or black or have a different color and are not transparent. So what I'm going to do is take the cap off and then I found this adorable tape online. I'll put the link down below to where I bought it. And also duct tape works just as great. And I'm just going to take my tape and I'm going to wrap it around the pen. But I'm going to wrap it like this instead of wrapping the whole thing because I want the design to look really nice. And then it looks like this. It looks so cute. And you're going to take some clear tape if you want. This is optional. But it will really help keep the design nice and clean and will also protect it and give it a nice shine. And just wrap it up in that. Make sure there are no air bubbles. And then you're done! Aren't these so cute? I love them and there's really a million designs you can do. Just look online and you'll find a trillion designs of kawaii paper that you like and you'll want to use. And this will definitely make your school supplies a lot better than those boring and dull pens you buy at the store. So I'm also going to be having a giveaway and all you have to do is like this video, subscribe to my channel, and comment down below some original DIY back to school video ideas. 
Comment as many ideas as you want, but try to think outside the box so I can do videos that other crafters haven't done. I will choose the best comment on September 1st and announce the winner in my craft contest winner video. So that's it guys, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed, bye!